little Bo Peep. But Mother Goose, that's an old story. Everybody knows it. Oh, really? Well, you're so smart. What happens to Grimmy in the end? Grimmy? He's not in that story. Oh, he is now. I've updated it for today. Little Bo Peep had lost her sheep and didn't know where to find them. We all know this story. <clears throat> a doggy nearby was giving a sigh, scratching the itch behind him. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, oh, that's good. That's it. That's it. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Are you a little sheep? I'm not even a sheep dog. Besides, my fleece, I mean fur, is not exactly white as snow. And it's overrun with fleas. See? Now there on his back, you could find quite a pack of those goose dwell in small parasites. With their brood very large, they're the Galdo and Marge, who are just having one of their fights. Aldo, I need a new coat before the white stuff starts to fall. You mean my little parasitic princess? No, Sandra. What is wrong with the one you have got? The same thing that's wrong with your head. It's full of holes. And make it a warm one. Made of wool. Six billion fleas in this world. I need to fall for one with cold blood. Just my luck. A rainstorm. <laughs> You're getting tears all over my fur. Not that I couldn't use the shower. Look, if you stop crying, I'll help you look, all right? Good. Let's go. Now the wandering sheep of Little Bo Peep were off where she shouldn't have missed them. But one of the fold had a plan that was bold and a very great need to enlist them. Oh, look at you. Don't you care that you're going to wind up like sweaters, woolly mittens, warm socks, and... Lamb chops. Hey, before we're troped off to mint jelly heaven, I say we give him something to remember us by. Who's with me? Well, what? Are you just gonna graze on your life? Or are you just gonna follow me like sheep? That's the spirit. Walk this way. In almost no time, they had all turned to crime. Every single last wool-bearing beast. Though the cops did their best, they could make no arrest. Watching store after store getting fleeced. Okay, guys, let's use our secret weapon. Hey, pal, count us. The count you? Don't ask questions, just count us. Oh, all right. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Wakes every time. Sheldon, grab the jewels. Larry, grab the cash. Artie, empty the safe. Putting victims to sleep, these criminal sheep would grab up the loot and then scram. Let the merchants beware, for the sheep didn't care, spending all of their lives on the land. I recognize these tracks. Synthetic fabrics. Marge better appreciate what I do for her. Talking to wild polyester. Little Bo Peep searched for her sheep, but there seemed to be not many traces. With the doggy named Grim, she would travel with him to what seemed to be all the wrong places. <laughs> Ta-da! Your sheep. Those aren't my sheep. Those are the Los Angeles rams. What's the difference, ram, sheep? Hey, let's see if they'll waggle their tails behind them. Around every block, they searched for the flock, Ooh. while the crime wave increased in its size. Bo Peep almost screamed for the sheep had it seen, pulled the wool over everyone's eyes. Are these your sheep? <gasps> oh! Oh, thank goodness, those aren't my sheep. Can I get those in a doggy bag? Hmm? They searched through the night, but no sheep were in sight. Many times in exhaustion, they cried out. Ah! Then to left 
that was blind they just happened to find where the sheep had been making their hideout. You can't let the cops catch us. You know what the penalty is when a sheep commits robbery? Five to ten years of hard grazing. <gasps> Little Bo Peep. Aha! We found the sheep! Ma, ma. We'll just be leaving. Now you were fine. You ain't gone anywhere, dog. Hey, who am I to turn down hospitality? Will you be serving hors d'oeuvres soon? I'm famished. All right, Chief. We know you're in there. You left Lanolin friends at your last job, so we followed you here. Come up with your hooves up. Break out the clippers. We're going in after them. Larry, you cover the window. Sheldon, you cover the door. Wait for my signal. Grammy! Grammy, what are we gonna do? Do the words passing out mean anything to you? The sheep said no cop, am I gonna let stop my gang and our beautiful racket? Well, upon Grimmy's rear, little Aldo was near to surrender on finding the jacket. It's no use. Marge is just gonna have to do without a new coat. <laughs> Wonderful. Nothing but the best for my baby. 